Welcome to my SU News Channel. Daniel Jones confirms he's ready to go for Giants Week 9 game in Las Vegas. Daniel Jones expects to be back under center on Sunday when the Giants travel to Las Vegas to face the Raiders. The fifth-year quarterback confirmed Tuesday during his weekly appearance on FanDuel TV's Up and Adams with Kay Adams that he was cleared and was gearing up to play. Jones, 26, has been dealing with a neck injury that forced him to be a limited participant in practice for the last two weeks and missed the previous three games. I'm cleared, I'm ready to go. Barring any setbacks this week, I'll be ready to go, Jones said. We'll see, we got a few days to prep and get ready to go, but the plan is to be out there on Sunday. Giants head coach Brian Dable said Monday that Jones had been given the green light for contact and had actually received medical clearance prior to their game against the Jets this past Sunday at MetLife Stadium. Jones cleared up the timeline of events during his interview with Adams. Met with the doctors during the week and didn't pass the tests at that point. I was closer, but still hadn't passed the tests, Jones explained. Then all the doctors come to the game, so met with them at the game and got cleared for this week. I went through the tests throughout the week and couldn't pass, so they didn't feel good about clearing me last week, but on Sunday met with them again and they felt good about clearing me for this week. The good news on Jones is that it helped the Giants avoid a bigger issue at quarterback after backup quarterback Tyra Taylor suffered a rib injury against the Jets in the 13-10 overtime loss. That forced the Giants to have to turn to third-stringer Tommy DeVito following the injury to Taylor on Sunday. Even with Jones on the field, the Giants have struggled, as he's thrown just two passing touchdowns and six interceptions on 884 passing yards. The Giants are 1-4 in his five starts this season. Source, nypost.com Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.